He had wealth and success, but found emptiness. This man's incredible journey to faith will inspire you. Stay tuned to hear the story. Welcome back to our YouTube channel following Padre Pio. If you're new to our channel, Padre Pio was a Capuchin friar, mystic and miracle worker whose intercession is still very powerful and active today. We publish videos and shorts five days a week, so follow us to find out more about the life of this fascinating saint and you will be amazed at what Padre Pio can do for you, a family member or a friend. Hello everyone! Before we dive into today's testimony, I'd like to express my heartfelt gratitude for the incredible support, feedback and personal stories that you, our viewers, have generously shared with us. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts, from both myself and the entire team. If any of you watching have stories or experiences related to Padre Pio, please feel free to share them in the comment section below or via email at info at followingpaterpio.org. Now the testimony I'm about to share with you was sent to our Padre Pio apostolate via email. It's a remarkable story about a man, whose identity will remain anonymous, who went from being an ardent atheist and pornographer to becoming a fervent Catholic. Please note that the email wasn't addressed to me personally, but the impact of this story is truly profound. Without further ado, let's dive right in. It has been several months since I became a protected son of Padre Pio, although I know I don't deserve such a title at all, and I had the grace to receive the blessed statue of our holy Padre Pio on Christmas Eve, along with the prince, and witnessed like never before in my life the tremendous power when touching them and praying the rosary on my knees before them, which made me feel as if my heart was in terrible yet wonderful flames that brought me to the ground. The thing is, I was a pornographer, and I worked illustrating comics and posters that were terribly obscene and even blasphemous for many years of my life. I even got rich from this. I was also a militant atheist for many years. I continued producing this horrendous content until after my firm conversion. I decided to abandon everything, deleting passwords, accounts, websites from all the places I had control over. Today I am confirmed and about to marry a devout Catholic bride who knows what I did in the past. I fight as best as I can to help with evangelization and seek indulgence for these and all my sins. Given the online reach of my diabolical pornographic works, I know with absolute certainty that I led at least a million people into the sin of masturbation, probably much more as they replicate and will continue to replicate my works on the internet especially after realizing that I have suddenly and completely removed my works from my platforms and files and do not provide them under any conditions. I fervently believe in purgatory, and I know that if God graces me with the mercy of salvation, I deserve immeasurable punishment, which, if unavoidable, I accept. Therefore, I come to implore you, whom I consider a great friend, although we do not know each other, to pray for me to Padre Pio and to dedicate with special intention, however discreet it may be, at least one Mass in my name and for the conversion of all those whom my venomous work has affected. Humbly grateful for your attention. End of letter. Now, I'd like to extend my sincere respect to the gentleman who wrote this letter. It takes a lot of courage to abandon a profitable business, and I can't imagine you had any support from your friends and colleagues. They probably thought you had lost your mind. However, what good would it be if one gains the whole world but loses their soul? Although harm was certainly done, you have shown that your love for Christ is stronger than your love for money, and that is something worth admiring. 
Thank you for sharing your sincere testimony and thank you for becoming a protected child of Padre Pio. If you too wish to help us spread Padre Pio's words of hope, please consider joining our Protected Children of Padre Pio program. By joining, you become a Padre Pio apostle, helping us to continue our work of bringing Padre Pio to the world, to the ones who need him most, for example, like our convert in this story. So please don't miss the opportunity to be a part of this important mission and click the link in the description below to find out more. Thank you for listening and stay tuned for the next video on the life of Padre Pio.